This is the Horse Radio Network. This is episode 406 of Horse Tip Daily, a different horse tip, a different equine topic, a different equestrian expert every day. Horse Tip Daily brings the world of equine knowledge to you one day at a time. This tip is sponsored by EcoGold. Visit them at ecogold.ca. Hi, everybody. Glenn the Geek back with you from Lexington, Kentucky, and you're listening to Horse Tip Daily. Well, today I am going to actually do the tip myself. We had an email that I thought I would share with everybody. It's going to be very short today, so so I won't take up too much of your day. But first, this tip is sponsored by Eco Gold, and we'll be right back with my tip. Well, you've heard me tell you about Eco Gold. Now let's hear from one of the professional riders that actually uses the products uh, every day in her professional career. And that is eventer, international Canadian eventer, Jessica Phoenix, WEG hopeful for 2010. Let's hear from Jessica and see how she likes Eco Gold. I love Eco Gold products. I've used their saddle pads and their cross country and open front show jump boots for over a year now, and I'm just thrilled with the results. They're very breathable, they provide great protection, and all of our horses have benefited from using them in competition. Well, thanks, Jess, and you can learn more about all of Eco Gold's products by going to ecogold.ca. That's ecogold.ca. We thank Eco Gold for their continuing support of the Horse Tip Daily Show. Well, I got an email a while back from Ashley Porter, who wrote, Hi, Glenn. Uh, we just posted an article called 50 Horse and Equestrian Blogs. And it was actually on a site I'd never heard of, veterinariantechnician.org, uh, which kind of uh, I thought was kind of an odd place to find 50 Horse and Equestrian Blogs. And it was uh, really well done, too. I thought I'd bring it to your attention in case you think your listeners would find it interesting. And she also says, I'm happy to let you know that your site has been included in this list. Either way, thanks for your time. And that was Cheers, Ashley Porter. And I went to check it out, and I kind of like it. I mean, I recommend that you guys go check it out, too. What she has done is she's basically listed 50 horse and equestrian blogs that they have found interesting over at a over at uh, veterinariantechnician.org. And, you know, some of them are learning horses, uh, about horses, Catherine's horse blog, um, horse personality, one called Teaching of a Horse, uh, Equine Inspiration is one called Resnix Horse Blog, which I've been to, Crazy Horse Women, which I found interesting, um, Nuzzling Muzzles. Oh, that's a great name for a blog, Nuzzling Muzzles. This blog is uh, great for beginners and those looking learning to train horses from an amateur's perspective. And then she says there's plenty of information to learn, Put the blogger, but the blogger makes it easy to understand. Uh, Gray Horse Matters, I've heard of that one. Savvy Equestrian, oh, Horse Tip Daily, there's one that uh, you've probably heard of. Ethical Horsemanship is uh, one of the blogs, Diary of a Young Horse. And then she gives a little description of each one, so you can go check it out. Uh, and there's a total, as I said, of 50 of them on here. Artistic Dressage is one of them. The Aspiring Equestrian, The Stable, Equestrian Blog, Midwest Horse Blog, uh, Once Upon an Equine, which I thought was a clever name. So, you know, I'm going to put the link to this in our show notes. Uh, I highly recommend you give it a try. And uh, the website itself is uh, veterinariantechnician.org, but then it's a long name after that. So I'll put it in the show notes and over on our Facebook page at Horse Tip Daily as well. Uh, You know, my tip today is uh, if you're interested in reading, if you're interested in blogs, there's some really good question ones out there. Stop on over here. It puts 50 of them in one place. Uh, Check them out, and I hope you enjoy. We'll be back again tomorrow with another new expert and a different horse tip. Until then, check us out 9 a.m. every morning, Horses in the Morning. Uh, Jamie Jennings and I doing our thing at 9 a.m. Eastern. And you can find all the other shows on the Horse Radio Network at horseradionetwork.com. Have a great day, everybody, and we'll be back again tomorrow. Wear your helmet. The Horse Radio Network and the Horse Radio Network hosts are not responsible for statements of guests or their opinions. Use your own judgment when listening to the tips provided by the experts on Horse Tip Daily. 